Hello everyone, Xenosim here. Welcome back to Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Last time, uh, well, off screen, if I remember correctly, I mostly did side quests. But I've had a roadblock, so I think the game wants us to progress the story at least a little bit before we can do more. Is it? Friends, jumping bull! <laughs> All go to Erith! Jump? In that? You're nuts, Furball! You have nothing to fear. This will take us to Erith Sea. Really? RFC. Who would have thought Erith Sea was right on top of Ricky's village? Dive deep enough, you can reach their tree. Perhaps you should try. Might do. Haven't decided yet. Is something wrong? Aren't you curious? About why we're going to Prison Island, I mean. It is not common for Homs to visit this region. You may have good reason, but forgive me. I do not pry into other people's business. It's definitely bugging her, Shulk. How, how dare you, you clown? It's okay, Melia. We're not strangers anymore. Well, I... <sighs> you're right. So then you'll listen to our story? Yes. Tell me why you were here. Basically, it all started when... I see. I had heard about the Mechon assault on the lower regions, but did not know the situation was so grave. How lucky we are. Hey, what's that? Is that? You are looking at Prison Island. So that's Prison Island? Yes. And that is the Imperial capital, Alkamoth. It's not just me, right? A floating city is a bit weird. Built with superior defenses in mind. Incredible. What technology makes this possible? I do not know, and I've never had the need to. You don't know? It doesn't freak you out? You can eat bread without knowing how to bake it. Makes sense to me. You will need Imperial sanction to enter Prison Island. Okay. We will travel to the capital first. And how do you expect us to get up there? Fly? 
There is a transporter up ahead. We can use that. We've been deep sea diving. Now we're gonna fly. This place gives me the creeps. I guess we don't have a choice. Right. Onwards to the capital. Still. What is it, Dunban? It's a sight to behold. Those look like anti mechon defense systems. Let's heal? Sure. And while we can go back to Frontier Village, I don't want to get you guys stuck. So, instead, I'm going to continue story, at least until a certain point. So let's head on to Alkamov. And this is a godsend. Lovering Reef, one. And, ooh, those are familiar things. Lovering Reef, two. Them. I believe. Yep, this is where our walk ends. Here. The center gate. Who are these guys? Are those wings on their head? They must be high end here. Welcome home, Lady Melia. Lady? Huh? Thank you, Captain. These Homs and this Nopon are my guests. See them safely to the guest quarters. Give them anything they need. As you wish. What's going on? I have no idea. Melia, are you...? Melia. I cannot speak now, but I shall fulfill my promise. I understand. I will arrange for an audience with the Emperor. Will you wait? We won't move an inch. Trust me. My thanks. Lady Melia, he says. Shulk, you're thinking the same as me. Whatever her position is here, Melia won't let us down. I'm sure you're right. <gasps> More of these guys. And... I must report the Telethia's defeat to His Majesty and request entry to Prison Island.
Choke is depending on me. I must hurry to the audience chamber. And we switched to Melia. So we can only go one path. And welcome to Alchemoth. You say the second consort's child survived her ordeal? Forgive me, first consort. I, Tyrea, vow to see your orders fulfilled. Whilst she's in the capital, do not underestimate the lengths to which His Majesty and the child's loathsome goons will go. How, pray tell, will you avoid the guards? I will do whatever it takes. Oh, your stupidity bores me. Your Highness, Enough I... of your drivel! We will have our chance when she stakes her claim to the throne. The Imperial Capital, Alchemoth. One of two areas that, because of how big they are, can crash the Wii version. Oh, can't go back. Alright. Attention, all. I believe we can go up to the balcony and yep, get a sky terrace. Sky terrace. We're almost level 40. We'll soon be level 40, so. Melia Antiqua, First Princess, has returned, Your Majesty. Raise your head. Your Majesty. The Telethia rained havoc on countless veteran knights. You triumphed where they could not. <laughs> I find it difficult to suppress these feelings of pride for you, my kin. That's your majesty. I failed to return with any of the subjects you entrusted to me. My inexperience cost them their lives. Mm, we will grieve for them. But it could not have been avoided. It was their duty and honor to fight beside you. They were all aware of your limits. Emperor! Keep those feelings of frustration close to you. It will help you to remember the debt you owe to those that have fallen. Your Majesty, concerning such debts, there were others who aided me. The Homs and Nopon that accompanied you to the capital, they have been arrested by Imperial security. Shulk and his companions? Yes, for reasons pertaining to the weapon this Shulk possesses. Shulk's weapon? Do you mean the Monado? So it is true. If that weapon is truly the Monado, we shall be forced to take action. Why? There is a legend, passed down through the generations, of a divine weapon, the Monado. It is said that the Bionis itself bestows the blade upon a Chosen One. However, if the Chosen One is black of heart, he will cause the destruction of the High Entia. Among Hyentia exist the good and bad alike. 
Homs and Nopon are no different. If this boy is the Chosen One. The Divine Seer's interrogation will reveal where his allegiances lie. So you intend to keep them confined? We must. Father, I mean, Your Majesty. I assure you, Shulk is of pure heart. As my successor, you will play a role of great importance. Calm your spirit and be patient. I... Dear sister, I can see the Emperor's words have confused you. Brother. His Majesty has spoken. He recognizes you as the Crown Princess. You are to be the next ruler of the High Entia. Me? And not you? Yes. The Emperor asked for my counsel, and I told him as I tell you now. You will make a fine Empress. There is no one more suited to leading our people. You proved that when you dispatched the Telethia. I... don't know what to... Melia. But the soldiers? I am not fit to rule. I should visit their families and beg for pardon. Melia, you know that this is not allowed. I know. But it does nothing for the guilt I feel. It is as the Emperor said. Grieve their departing and engrave in your heart their great deeds. I will. You are right to question these things, but take pride in who you are. The Emperor has chosen wisely in you, Melia. I am to be Crown Princess. Yes, you are. The Ministries of Research and Records are united in support of His Majesty's decision. I, Minister Lorithea, have no objection to your appointment. I understand. I would never openly question our Divine Emperor. But the wielder of the Monado, the Chosen One, might be a useful tool. You think so too? Yes. But a lowly servant of the realm such as myself could never question his majesty. However, if the Divine Seer were to intervene... The Seer could free Shulk. They should be exchanging words as we speak. Idiot bird brains. What do we do? A fancy prison is still a prison. What happened to Melia? I don't see her locked up in here with us. Exactly. She's in on this. Shulk, any thoughts here? Melia won't let us down. She promised to take us to Prison Island. And she's not the kind of person to break a promise. Okay, Shulk. You win. I believe you. And if you believe Melia, then no arguments from me. And... Temporarily switch... Shulk. We just have to talk to everyone, I believe. Yeah. What's up? And with that, you are to be interrogated by the Divine Seer. Stand back. Oh. 
Alvis. What are you doing here? I see. So that is why you are here. Is Melia okay? We didn't mean to cause her any trouble. Rest assured, she is fine. The real reason you have been detained is not because you are outsiders. You don't mean... Yes. The Monado. You see, the High Entia and the Monado go back many years. Millennia, in fact. Ah. Oh. Leave everything to me. I shall see to it that you are not held for long. We cannot have the saviors of Her Highness treated as criminals now, can we? Free these people. I shall take responsibility for their actions whilst inside the capital. They are now guests of the Imperial family. Sir. I am required to report to His Majesty. Otherwise, I would escort you around the capital. Use this room at your leisure. You are free to roam the city or stay here and rest. Farewell. Hold on, Alvis. I need to ask you... Be patient. I know what it is you wish to ask. Do not fear. You will learn when the time is right. The life of the rich. So where are we going? Anywhere but here. I'm bored of this stuffy room. Okay, then. Ricky, find Melly for Shulk. Ricky, wait. Your Eminence. What God want? If you're after Alvis, he's gone. What? Where did he go? What happened? We received an SOS from a small squadron repairing a transporter at Aerith Sea. But the transmission was interrupted, and we have lost all contact with the squadron. Sounds like they need our help. Sure, can Ricky go help? Ricky and friends help people in trouble! Of course. We're happy to help. But you're outsiders. Soldier man, not worry. Hereupon Ricky is here to save the day! It is... most appreciated. We need all the help we can get. Main menu. Still trees. Okay, party. Now let's go. We can finally explore the capsule. And of course, we can start. Collecting quests. Of course, which we will just do because it's just. Yeah, you know, just grabbing them. Yes? 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 Just keep. Yes. 
Yes. Yes. Come on. There's yes. more. Another shop. The popular staff, which will be useful from earlier. Don't like that. Uh, this I like. Okay. So we'll get six. Six of you. Six of you. Six of you. And now, first of all, Starlight Kick, Summon Copy, Summon Flare, and Summon Bolt. Oh, well, Kevin. Get Melly is done now. With that, now we'll have to reset everything. Ah, uh, first of all, give a really quick step. Gems, because he will need it. Strength up. Dumb man. You get a lot of the jelly ups. Fence up. Some HP ups. Topple resist. Shulk, AP up. You know what? Give Shulk the experience up.
Jilly up. That's why I'll give shock for now. Uh, you know what? Let's see what we can do. Charge or swing. Uh, steel strike. Nearly just a lure. Heal round. The annoying thing is, oh, I did it again. I should have gone for Battle Soul. Oh well. Eventually, I'll get much more. But that filling the talent arch, our gauge is fine. Uh, truly outrageous. Yeah, there's some requests, but let's try and get the story done. Yeah, this is the power of quick step gems. get everywhere quickly. The only time I can I can see them not being good is literally one for one thing. For one art one area. And even then Get alert. Just cool down during the day. Now we fly up there. Nice. 
Nice strike. Up. Uh, no, we're running. You know what? Let's go up here. I don't know if we can actually do this quest. Hey. Oh yeah. That noise is irritable. What is it? What is it? What oh my god. Dumb on learning your art, which I believe is Thunder. I I'm weird for this move. Because I like the Forces Days by heat, but you have to literally get around the target. It's easier to do obviously when you've got Gale Slash. But it's also just a case of why. Nope. No, 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 we're not fighting. Leave. Yeah, no, we don't have it yet. Because he's got a very good break art, in my opinion, at least. Uh, let's try to ignore this guy for now. Take some of that resistance before. So we can get a good drop. Everything. Remember that. Ricky wants to move, yes? 
Hold on to that talent art for now, Ricky. You can't even do that. Nice. Better heal up quite a bit. Also, yeah, you probably might have noticed. <laughs> Since we've gotten a much longer look at HP, man. Uh, Ricky's almost at uh, 9, 9, 9, 9. We're not even uh, half. Way through half levels. Who else wants some? Not bad, not bad at all. The crowbar. Are you that? And with that we're done. So with time. And that is the extent of my discussions with the Homs that accompanied Melia here. I still cannot believe it. How could a Telethia have grown to such power? And what is your conclusion, Seer? That the Telethia were able to gain such power due to the high levels of ether in the region. In other words, our ether protection is weakening. And so it begins. The resurrection of the Bionis. What of the Monado? I cannot see. My sight is hindered. However... Speak, Seer. It is not certain that the Monado will bring about our destruction. While my sight is hindered, I have seen a sliver of light. Is your majesty not aware of this light as well? Are you referring to Melia? And the young man, Shulk. Could it be that the boy is trustworthy after all? Kalyan, we are on the cusp of a significant moment. The investiture ceremony must take place as soon as possible. Your Majesty, since the ministries are already in agreement, we may be able to bypass some of the formalities. Indeed. But she must still earn the blessing of the people. Might I suggest the trial of the tomb? First consort, such a ritual has not been conducted for generations. We have simply not had a need for it until now. And I feel she is more than equal to the challenge. Mother, the tomb is dangerous. Our records show that many potential successors lost their lives performing the ritual. That child fought and beat the Telethia. It is my belief that she is more than strong enough. Besides, if it was revealed that she avoided such a responsibility, her reputation among the people would be irreparably damaged. I must protest. No, no, no. The first consort is right. There is much risk. But the rewards are greater. It would seal the people's love for her. Summon Melia. Her thoughts must be heard. I 
accept. If I am to lead the High Entia despite my mixed heritage, if I am to succeed the throne, then I accept what must be done. I expect nothing less of my successor. The path to greatness is fraught with danger. This shall be your statement to Bionis. Yes, your majesty. You are not fit to be empress. Not now, not ever. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, looks like we got them out of a scrape. Shulk, Ricky tired. <sighs> Ricky sleeping castle now. Good idea. Let's head back to the capital. The sooner the better. Yeah. But... Because it's going to be quite a bit, and I feel... It'd be wrong. I'm going to use the time to go to Frontier Village, quickly check the quest, and then ep end the episode. There is another quest. Oh, this is an open stage quest. We'll talk about. We'll do the off screen. But we're definitely not ready to do his quest. Okay, yes, we can actually start doing one of the quests, well, quest lines. We still cannot continue Lupa's, but Lupa has to wait until the bridge is fixed, which is not until everything, everything story related in Alchemoth is done. To do this, and we might as well do this now. Right, this is one of the time quests. We need. Actually, we need to change the time about it. Look for Gadara in Magna Forest.
So. You'll start. God. Oh, got a high end here. Turn. Go see Cherry. Change the time. Quest complete. Uh, I don't, I don't like those jets, but the experience is good. Finally, we get Tantrum, which I prefer to have over there. Ah, uh, we're maxing this out. It's really good. Uh, we do need area maps. Because Dada has a quest for us, which we'll do next time. But we'll start it now. <laughs> I forgot. Right, let's head down and next time we'll continue the quest. This is Zeno and Zima, signing out.